we are so grateful. The Friends of Dakin Pool will receive $45,000 in pandemic relief funds from the Penobscot County Commissioners. The grant will go towards the nonprofit's Jump In campaign to make improvements to the pool, which the community may be able to enjoy as early as next summer. Look forward to a new slide. We're also working with the city to resurface the pool deck, which is pretty old and cracked and in need of repair. We're supporting lifeguards, so new and improved Dakin Pool. The money brings the Friends of Dakin Pool halfway to their fundraising goal of $160,000. The group originally formed nearly 20 years ago, but has ramped up efforts due to recent struggles. During COVID, of course, the pool came on hard times and was not able to open fully that summer, and so the, the Friends was revived. There was some concern about the pool getting attention. We decided it was time to step back in and revisit the issue. Penobscot County Commissioner Peter Baldacci says the pool provides an important service for the city. It serves a neighborhood, it serves uh, uh, communities that uh, maybe can't afford uh, country clubs and private swimming pools, and this is a project that will benefit so many families. Some say the pool is a staple of Bangor. The Dakin Pool is, has really been around since the 50s and 60s, it's so been a long time. I went there 50, 60 years ago. This is where we got our swim lessons, so it means a lot. The pool will close for the season at the end of the week, but will continue to fundraise through their GoFundMe efforts. Visit the Friends of Dakin Pool Facebook page to learn more. In Bangor, David Ledford, ABC 7 and Fox 22 News.